Which of the following is an advantage of by CMOS logic? So you get the best of both worlds is what I said, the best of both worlds. They are not, CMOS is not immune to electrostatic damage. We're not worried about cost. That rules out that. So it has to have the high input impedance and the low output impedance of a BJT. So that I, I, it seems like I do remember that one. Which of the following circuits continuously alternates between two states without an external clock signal? That is an A-stable multivibrator. A 555 chip is sort of like an A-stable multivibrator. Um, it 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 doesn't have an external clock signal. It uses the RC time constant. So I feel like I'm on like who wants to be a millionaire, but you can miss a couple. What is the phase angle between the voltage across and the current through a series RLC circuit if the capacitive reactance is 300 ohms, the resistance is 100 ohms, and capacitive... This is where I needed that calculator. So um, let's go over here and let's add another scene and uh, let me fire up the calculator 